now we are moving to the next session paper presentation in this session we have two resource person so on behalf of department of commerce mejra college and global research forum i would like to extend my warm welcome to mr muthu kumar principal madurai kamraj university constant college madurai he has been connected to our department since 2002 he has presented many papers in international conferences in singapore vietnam and dubai he has uh, received achiever of the year award in 2011 we are grateful to you sir for accepting our invitation welcome sir next our heartiest welcome to our resource person dr k uma assistant professor department of commerce madurai kamraj university she is also connected with our department and college since 2002 when she has worked here for about 7 years she has published about 30 articles in national and international uh, journals and presented about 50 uh, papers in national and international seminars she has been awarded the best assistant professor award we welcome you ma'am uh, so now uh, uh, sir i will i would like to hand over the session uh, to prakash sir uh, for a, a scholarly presentation session thank you ma'am so uh, the presentation part is going to start now so as dr mail murgan sir said so we are allowing you 5 minutes for the presentation and their slide presentation and later the question answer session will be there so uh, we have to wind up uh, the in a fast type of presentation as well as the question answer session so uh, i am welcoming Dr. Lina Akka Matthew, are you ready? Yes, sir. Yes. I hope I'm start. audible. Yes. Okay. So I would like to make a presentation on the cyber crimes against children. Okay. I would like to present on cyber crimes against children, and uh, in fact, we all know uh, that there are various cyber crimes in the uh, current world because everyone is using. Uh, information and communication technology uh, the laws which are applicable over here are the information technology act as well as the um, in in which different types of cyber crimes like um, uh, identity theft uh, which commonly happens among children when they uh, use accounts or they create fake accounts of other children and uh, operate also cyber bullying uh, is another Uh, type of offense however we do not find any kind of specific offense in the information technology act then also offenses of cyber uh, pornography that the protection of children against sexual offenses act the poxo act of 2012 deals with these particular uh, types of issues regarding sexual offenses uh, so um, we can see also the offense of um uh, of phishing where an a fake uh, email account is created and other offenses are with regard to fraud cyber fraud and in in, in that the in, in fact uh, these type of offenses the in, in the indian penal code comes into being so the poxo act the information technology act and the indian penal code are the The, the three different legislations which deal with the offenses regarding uh, to uh, in in the cyber space or cyber crimes against children however we can still see that uh, in after the after section 66a was struck down in the shreya singles case uh, posting of annoying or annoying or uh, disparaging defamatory remarks um is no longer is no longer or uh, uh, this kind of offensive remarks is no longer uh, a crime under the information technology act so this has actually done a lot of disservice to children who are being cyber bullied and now we can see because of that cyber bullying is no longer an offense under the information technology act or otherwise maybe the I, uh, the indian penal code provisions of uh, defamation or such kind of um, other provisions would have to be taken into account in order to charge a person 
of these kind of uh, offenses like cyberbullying. So we we can see that uh, even today there are still defects in the law which still have to be addressed. Um, the only thing that we can do proactively is to educate the children and uh, tell them about the, the risks that are existing in the cyber world so that they will be able to uh, guard themselves from falling prey to cyber crimes. So thank you. Any questions from, from the dais or any participants? No, no, sir. Okay, okay, thank you. Uh, so thank you, ma'am.